feeling so small Watch the clock ticking off the wall But tonight I'm letting it go Spend Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be another clean with me video um, But it's going to be a clean and decorate with me video. So today I'm decorating my console table upstairs in my um in my upstairs landing um you guys are going to get a full house tour um coming very soon i'm just finishing up some last minute things in the house but i just wanted to take you guys along with just like a few places in my house that i am still decorating and this is one of them i love to decorate my upstairs landing it's one of my favorite areas in my house um and I just, I just love to throw pops of colors and just different things um, on my console table. This area does change from time to time, but I do think that I am pretty pleased with it. This dresser I got from the Salvation Army, and I believe I got it for $39, and I just love it. Um, it is a part of... It's actually a part of a full set, but I have the top part in my kitchen and the bottom part I wanted to put um, in my upstairs landing. So here I am starting to decorate. And this mirror I got from the Habitat for Humanity, and I believe it was $20 that I paid for it. It's extremely heavy, you guys. It is so heavy. And I was trying to figure out a space um, where to place it because i tried everywhere in my house and i just didn't like it but it actually looks so much better here so if you guys can remember this um this flowery centerpiece that i made um i had made it for my farmhouse chic dining room tour and um because i chose based on your answers the dining room that it is now the style i decided to put this upstairs on my landing and i think it goes so well with the farmhouse look that i'm going for sort of like a chic farmhouse i don't want it to be too over the top farmhouse because i don't like too much of the farmhouse style but i like to take some bits and pieces of farmhouse um from the farmhouse style itself so here I am just adding some pumpkins and as you can tell my color for for the fall season is yellow um, gingham plaid like I love that white just light and airy um, yellow is my favorite color but I wanted to keep the same color as I used in the summertime because I didn't want to go out and have to buy different colors and all those things for the fall. I just wanted to keep it light and airy and I think that it goes so well with all my decor that I have. Um, if you guys can remember the sign, I bought it from Hobby Lobby and um, I had it in my kitchen. I had it <laughs> so many places in my kitchen um, and I just moved it upstairs because I thought that it would look so much better on that wall and it really, really does. It accentuates the entire wall and just makes make it look so beautiful and fabulous and I just love the light and airy feel of this um, this style of decor on my upstairs uh, mantle here well not mantle but console table so here I'm just kind of showing you guys the entire background of it that's my baby girl Nyla she is going to be 13 in two months and I am super excited and that's Michaela and my son and my hubby uh, when they were a lot smaller and um, also I wanted to show you guys um, this little pumpkin that I made but first as you can see I'm a sucker for faux plants because I can't keep real ones alive <laughs> so this gingham um, pumpkin I made out of just regular material and the material was only like a dollar fifty um i made that i have a few of them kind of just laying around the house and i made it out of that and twine and i love the way that it turned out this thankful sign i did get it from um hobby lobby you guys did see that in my hobby lobby haul that i did also the great pumpkins i got from hobby lobby and this little gingham uh pumpkin i also made that out of the same material and twine and just a little fall leaf I think that it adds a touch of fall, a touch of elegance, and a touch of chic to my design. I am so loving my fire, my 
centerpiece. I was about to say my fireplace, but I'm still loving my centerpiece this year on my console table. I think it's whimsical, it's beautiful, and the pops of yellow just gives it a completely different feeling for the fall. I absolutely love it. This lamp I got from Walmart and it was $29.99. I love the way that this turned out, you guys, and I hope that you do too. If you like this look, give it a, a thumbs up. This is what it's going to be for the fall season, going into Thanksgiving, and of course, I'm going to change it up for Christmas. But if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more little five-minute decorating videos here and there, let me know. I'll leave a comment down below if you have not yet subscribed to my channel please go ahead and do so and for all my older subscribers thank you guys so much i love you all so very much don't forget to press the bell and i will see you guys in the next episode thank you guys so much for watching remember that jesus is lord jesus loves you and so do i bye guys happy fall Feeling so small, watch the clock ticking off the wall. But tonight I'm letting it go. Spend my coin for sure. I'm gonna be myself, or I could be someone else.